But yeah, excuse the very bad camera work, just doing a sort of one person, you know. So yeah, got this, this Sinclair C5 to um, do for a friend of mine. And um, took, the, took it off, you couldn't get the uh, belt to tighten up properly. Pulled the motor off, and then noticed instantly that this is obviously wobbly. You can probably, hopefully you can see it in the video. But yeah, well, well worn. So I've just put the matchsticks in. So obviously this is the white finger gearbox, which you can do this. So you just put out slightly your finger, put a matchstick in there, job done. Do it all around, around the side there. Then you can either put it sometimes, or if it hasn't been removed for a while, I just put a big flat headed screwdriver gently in there. And just that, so I was trying to just, just one handed. What's up? I was showing you. Do that, cool. Okay, let's just make sure it's on video still. Yeah, cool. So this is the first one that's been off. This is. So you have a look. So, as expected, and as I can clearly see there, and as you can see in the video, put on the slightly on the side there. There should be a bearing here on the end of this shaft here that then supports this part of this part here, the gearbox stops it wobbling around. And this is really, really common. It's um snapped off. Uh, in the middle there if you can see that so there's a bearing there should be attached there so basically this means that this core of this motor sort of commutator part as far as I as far as I'm concerned anyway it's basically tr um, trash now this this middle part is because you need that otherwise you'll put it in and as obviously it'll, it'll wobble around a little bit but this is also been this has also been used for a little while this is well well worn you know so you put the um pop that off if we can just uh Little tap on there, cool. Get it off there, sweet. Let's have a quick look at this whilst the video is running. That's all. Cool. So, yeah, tap it off. Um, and you can see where it's so worn. This is where the this is um where the bearing would normally go on here. That would normally be thick plastic, and you can see my finger can get in the gap there. So. It's worn, you know, a few millimetres round all around the outside, so that is, um, that's knackered basically. It's a shame because it's quite nice on there. Yeah, that's got a big group, that's, that's knackered. So that's knackered. This part looks okay. Outer casing's fine. Centre part's knackered. These teeth look good. Um, and the teeth from these, for little planetary gears, these look good as well, just on initial quick inspection. So yeah, so we're going to need a new gearbox part here out just the outer part and um new part there so really might need might be better just getting a new motor i expect okay hope that's of use to some people so i'll basically i'll clean all this up um i'll remove the center core take the take the two seven mil i think seven mil bolts out i'll mark it up with a pen like i normally do you know just so i sort of know really really easily how i'm how i'm reassembling it you know and then i'll just clean it all up and then obviously then look out for the parts we need nice one cheers